Hello and welcome back to my 4F4 experience and today we're doing the last voyage of the USS Constitution and I'm playing you a bit before we take off. Now I'm sure that everybody's done this mission over and over again throughout the various character builds that they've had but the bit that I'm interested in is surviving the journey. So there are five missions and two skirmishes uh, and I shall be showing you edited highlights of the missions because I really want to show you the end of the actual journey. Before we get too far ahead of ourselves, let's get this party started. Okay, so the first item I'm going to need is the NX42 which is in this filing cabinet in where the scavengers are. Next you make your way over to the ship and you'll be approached by a lookout who will then uh, conscript you into the Congressional Army and then you go upstairs and meet the captain. The captain requests your presence on the bridge. Have to double quick, madam. Right, so that's the mission started. Uh, soon we'll be able to use the uh, the rowboat that comes down at the back, but this time we just have to make our way through a few cutscenes of the robots Un and... Uh, identified. Yeah. Intruder. Intruder. Mr. First Mate, this is the captain. This soldier is no intruder. Requesting permission to use lethal force. This must be a misunderstanding. You invited me aboard. Not exactly the level of hospitality we were expecting. No records found. Stand down! That's an order! And for God's sake, use the accent! I, Captain, standing down. Captain Ironsides. I'll have none of your lip, Mr. Navigator. Have the crow's nest scan two points off the port bow. Jump to it. Aye, Captain. Our soldier has arrived. I trust the first mate didn't give you too hard a time. Been too long since we've seen the Congressional Army. I'm fine. I am Captain Ironsides, commander of the USS Constitution. You visit this fine vessel in oh, trying times. Just figured I hope you called these day. long years on her airy perch. Damn you, Weatherby Savings and Loan! I spit at you. That's quite a predicament. What vexes me most is my inability to assist in the war effort. My gun decks have not but more rats and ne'er do wells as targets. Enough pleasantries. The Constitution has systems that need repairs to carry out its mission. Okay, so I, uh, I took a reward and I, I encourage you to do that. Uh, so there's going to be five missions and during those missions there's going to be two lots of fighting. The scavengers are going to attack. That's the next thing that's going to happen now. Scavengers approach. Soldier, man the... <laughs> you get downstairs and if you can, shut down the lookout because it will be destroyed. Right, so then that's done, up to the navigator, get the mission for the chip, which you've already got earlier, the NX-42, and then we'll fit it into the, uh, and then that'll be that sorted, and then we'll go on to the next mission. Aiden system offline. Multiple errors diagnosed. First error. Guidance chip stolen. This unit requires its return. Dinghy unlocked. And available for right, so that's the uh, the dinghy unlock. That means we'll be able to earn access to the main deck without having to go through the ship. So make sure that the uh, mission's highlighted in your pit boy, and then it'll show you the next uh, piece of the chain, and you can go straight to it. Your very presence does this humble unit. A great honor. My programming would find it amiss if I did not also interject. Long live the captain! So you accept the mission and uh, you fix the cables which are in a box not very far from where we're standing. Now I've missed these cables before and jury rigged the boat, but at this time I'm trying to do it all to the book. Instead, I will await the cables repairs with unbridled anticipation. So make sure the mission's highlighted in your pit boy and it'll show you the next chain, uh, the next part of the chain that you have to go to. There's the cable, let's fit them. Permission 
to destroy intruder denied. Standing down. Right, so that's two out of three. You're now finding. Always, oh, wait a minute. I think I saw something down there. But you can always use vans if you've got it. I'll show you where where to go for the next one. And there it is there. Okay, so it's back to the bus and we go, and the Bicos Ray is up here, and this jetpack is so handy, it's been, I've been using it for all kinds, of, and it's essential for this mission. Bosun. Now, oh, course is through the Constitution's veins, again! Her systems, long starved, flick out to life! <laughs> A hearty congratulation. Huzzah! However, this has brought to light further failures in a power grid. The power relay. Shame. I previously complained about his Okay, so our next stop is Bunker Hill. Hey again, step right up. Little bit of everything from all over. Okay, so we've got the power coil. Coil, let's get back to the ship. And we're using the, the rowboat. This I can make it's very handy for getting up there. Okay, so we've got the power cord. Now, before we fit the power cord, we're going to see the navigator to the front, because he's got another problem, uh, and that's the other part of the mission that we have to do, uh, one after the other. Ahoy, soldier. Chip recovered. Dispensing bounty. Diagnostics report. One error remaining. Guidance radar's transmitter is not functional. Requires... Replacement. Okay, so that's the mission initiated. Go and get the stuff. It's at the Poseidon Energy Transfer, just on the other side of the, uh, the water there. Uh, so that's two missions we've got. Fix the power coils, which I'm going to do now after I've got this mission. And, and then I'm going to go and get the stuff at the Poseidon Energy uh, place. Okay. So we fit the uh, power coil, that uh, power core, power coil that we just bought from Bunker Hill. Warning, overdue for maintenance. Bosun. Power flows far and steady. I would applaud you, but alas, I cannot due to my lack of clapping instruments. But huzzah, madam, huzzah. Next up, we go to Poseidon Energy Transfer and get the required part. Right, we've arrived at the Poseidon Energy Transfer, the place where there is a suit of armour up there by a crashed vertebrate, uh, which is interesting, I'll go and get that later. So we're going to go in the factory, it's going to make a cut short, a little bit of action, and then uh, get that thing. Okay, so that's that mission sorted. Uh, we'll talk to the, uh, the navigator and then the captain for the final mission. Ahoy, soldier. Guidance system fully functioning. Bounty dispensed. It is required. You commence dialogue with the captain, madam. Men of service to our noble vessel. Despite ample provocation, I had hoped the guidance ship could be recovered without violence to the scavengers. Even now, they plot. Why did you want me to spare the scavengers? I confess they are a blight upon my existence. Those scallywags killed many of my marines. We're down to a skeleton crew due to that filth. But they are citizens of the Commonwealth. Citizens we're pledged to protect against foreign incursion. Which is not without its irony. 
I find I must reward your considerable efforts with the final labor. We stand but a hair's breadth away from embarking on our sacred mission. So now, can you tell me what's going on? Complete this task, and I will gladly relate our mission. Until then, silence, vigilance. The ship requires turbo pump bearings from a nearby factory. It will undoubtedly be a dangerous mission, but I have faith you will succeed. Okay, next stop is the Corvega factory where we have to get the bearings. So again, we're going to go there very quickly and uh, get this stuff. So we will arrive at the factory and we will go around the back uh, and with the jetpack of course I can like fly across the water which will make it very easy. Of course I learned right now that I did actually throw an artillery shell from the other side. Okay, uh, taken by surprise and then make our way into the building. Okay, that seems pretty simple, let's do it. In we go, and when you get to the big stairs, just go going all the way to the top, and you'll get to the place you need to be. set sail and our hero of the hour is to thank you've earned a double share madam well done okay so a shortcut scene with the robots and then the scallywags the iranians will start their attack and then uh, and then it will be the launch our twin nx 42 rockets will alight and then moor us from this dreaded savings and loan the constitution will launch into the heavens and after gently land in the ocean then we take our rightful place as defenders of the Atlantic. That's ambitious. As they say, nothing ventured, nothing gained. Mr. Navigator, put her through her paces. We need to... Those motherless curs! Prepare to broadside! Now I've seen uh, one of the robots down there, I think it's the lookout, but I know pretty sure and very soon that the navigator is going to be down there and so it's essential I think to get down there and shut him down to, uh, just in case he gets destroyed. Uh, there goes the navigator, so we've got two robots, so I'm going to go and do that now. Captain. Gods be good, the scavenger assault has been broken. Not one of those scallywags stepped foot on our vessel. All hands, prepare ship for launch. We've reached the moment where I will be uh, turning on the generator for the captain and the ship will be launched off into space and uh, I have to run back, get on the ship and survive the journey. Let's do this. So here we go, 
This is where the jetpack will come into its own as we make our way back to the ship. Commencing final countdown. We're at the final countdown and when we reach one, the robots will go inside the ship. Now I never saw that because I've never made it this far onto the actual ship during this part of the mission. So I'm following the captain into the ship and I think that's the key to surviving this uh, journey. Well, this is the first. I'm going to move around. I'm not sure if standing still or moving around is uh, good or not. Uh, so I'm going to try it. Well, that was great. We survived the journey. We actually survived the journey inside the boat. As I've never made it this far before and actually been on the boat when it arrived uh, and, and usually have to fight your way through. And I have known in the past that Ironsides does actually get destroyed because a huge amount of raiders decide to take the ship and, you know, they want what's on it. And so uh, they do get killed. So I think this might be an ongoing mission. Now I know everybody knows about the extra rockets that are all around the place. You know, there's one on a trailer, there's another one at the Ark Jack. I never used it in that mission. So that's still active. And of course, you don't get a notification in the pit boy of the ship being attacked. We get made uh, an honorary lieutenant. Uh, does that mean that we are now like second in command or actually in the command structure? And so any, if anything does happen to Ironside, does that mean we, we can possibly take command of the ship? Nobody really knows these questions and that's why I like to make these videos. So we get a cabin, we've got armor bench and a weapons bench um, and we can now fast travel to it because we've discovered it. I think this is an ongoing mission and this time I'm going to stay with the ship because of course while I'm on the ship, the captain will issue commands and I'll follow them. I trust you'll enjoy this episode as much as I've been making it and don't forget to catch my next film which is about surviving on the outside of the boat. Okay, so it's been great and I'll see you all again soon. Bye for now.